Hello everyone, today our topic is how to get email alerts for new Facebook lead ad leads. So I am a business owner and for promoting my business, I am running an ad campaign on my Facebook page through which I am getting a lot of leads. Now what I want is that I don't want to miss any of my lead, so I want to receive an email automatically as an alert on my Gmail account. So here my objective is that whenever I'm going to receive a new lead from Facebook lead ads, that automatically I'm going to receive an email with that lead details on my Gmail account. So for that, I have to build a connection between Facebook lead ads and Gmail. So for building this connection, I'm going to use Pavli Connect, which is an amazing software for automation and integration. In Pavli Connect, I have to use trigger and action. In trigger application, I'm going to use Facebook lead ads. In action application, I'm going to use Gmail. So how I'm going to build this connection for that, let me take you to my computer screen. I hope all you can see my computer screen and today we are going to see how we can get the email alerts for new Facebook lead ad leads. So I am a business owner and for promoting my business, I'm running an ad campaign on my Facebook page through which I'm getting a lot of leads. So this is my Facebook page which is named as Pabli Connect and I'm running an ad campaign on this particular page and through this, I'm getting a lot of leads. Now what I want is that I never want to miss any of my lead that I'm receiving from Facebook lead ads. So my objective here is that whenever I'm going to receive a new Facebook lead from Facebook lead ads, then automatically I want to receive an email alert on my Gmail account that I have received a new Facebook lead. And I want all this to happen automatically. So for doing this automatically, I have to use Pabli Connect. So Pabli Connect is an amazing software for automation and integration. And with Pabli Connect, I'm going to build a connection between Facebook lead ads and Gmail. And I'm going to build this connection without any coding and programming skills. Now with Pabli Connect, whenever I'm going to receive a new lead from Facebook lead ads, then automatically I'm going to receive an email alert for that particular lead on my Gmail account. So for using Pabli Connect, I have to open a new tab and search for pabli.com slash connect. And this will take us to this landing page of Pabli Connect. Here we have two options, sign in and sign up for free. If you don't have any account with Pabli Connect, then you just have to click here on this sign up for free button and it will take only two minutes of your time and you will get 100 of tasks free every month. Or if you already have an account, you can just sign in and you will get to see this page. So these are all the apps that Pabli offers and we are going to use Pabli Connect here. For that, I have to click here on this access now button under Pabli Connect and this will direct us to the dashboard of Pabli Connect. Here, this is the workflow section and we can see all the workflows that we will create here. And this is the folder section. We can create new folder here and we can save any workflow in any particular folder that we want. Now here, I want to create a new workflow. For that, I have to click here on this create workflow button and this window will pop up. Here, I have to name my workflow. So I'm going to name it as my objective, which is to get email alert for new Facebook lead ads lead. Now I have to select the folder where I want to save my workflow. So I'm going to open this tab and in this tab, I will find all the folders that I have created in my Pabli Connect account. And I'm going to use this particular folder of Facebook lead ads. So I'm going to select this and I'm going to click on create. And this will take us to this most important window of our workflow. Here we have two boxes, trigger and action. So these are the two main principles on which our workflow works on. And trigger says, when this happens, action says, do this. So trigger is going to be the first step that will get executed in our workflow and action will just follow that. So we have to set up our trigger first. And here, my trigger application is going to be Facebook lead ads. So I'm going to select Facebook lead ads here. And now I have to give a trigger event. So I'm going to open this tab. A new lead instant will be my trigger event. So I'm going to select this. And I'm going to connect Facebook lead ads with Pabli Connect. So I'll click here on connect. I will click on add new connection and I will connect with Facebook lead ads. And my connection here is successful. Now I have these two options, page and lead gen form. So here I have to first select my Facebook page that I want to use. So for that, let me take you to my Facebook account. And in this, I'm using this particular page of Pabli Connect. So this is my Facebook page on which I'm running an ad campaign. So I have to map this in Pabli Connect. So let me take you to Pabli Connect. And here for selecting the page, I have to open this tab. And in this tab, I will find all the Facebook pages that is connected with my Facebook account. So I'm going to search for my page, which is Pabli Connect. So I'm going to select this. And now I have to select my lead gen form. So for the lead gen form, I have to open this tab. And in this tab, I will find all the lead generation forms that are connected with my Facebook page. And I can use any particular lead gen form, but I'm going to use this all lead gen forms. 
and you can use any lead generation form that you want to use. Now here, I have this important note which says, please note that after clicking the save and send test request button, you will need to generate sample submission of your lead ad form by clicking on the preview form button and filling out the form. Make sure that lead generation form is live before making the sample submission. Now what I need to do is, I need to click on save and send test request button and here we can see it is waiting for webhook response. So how I'm going to get this webhook response, for that I have to create a sample submission and for creating a sample submission I'm going to use my default developer and I have to make sure that my lead generation form is live. So for getting this webhook response and for creating a sample submission, let me open Meta for developer and in this I will go to more and I'm going to open tools and in tools I'm going to use this lead ads r2 debug tool so I'm going to open this and here we can see we have these two tabs page and form. So first I'm going to select my page so I have to open this tab and in this I will find all the pages that are connected with my Facebook account and I'm going to use this particular page of Pabli Connect so I'm going to select this and my lead form is already selected. Now what I need to do is I need to click on preview form button and I have to create a sample submission. So I'm going to click here. So this is my form and in this I have all these details like first name, last name, email, phone number and the city. So I'm going to fill all these details to create a sample submission. So my first name is going to be demo, last name will be user, email will be demo user at the rate pablitudes.com and I'm going to give a random phone number. So this is going to be the random phone number of my lead. Now I have to give a city. So my city will be Bhopal. So I have filled all these details in my form. Now I'm going to click on next. I will click on submit. So I have submitted my form and I have created this new lead. Now what I need to do is I need to go back to Public Connect. And here we can see I have received this response. So in the response, I have the first name which is demo. I have the last name which is user. Email is demouser at the rate pablitudes.com and I have the random phone number of my lead and the city which is Bhopal. So here I have received all these details of my lead and now what I need to do is I need to use all these details and I want to receive an email on my Gmail account that I have received a new lead from Facebook lead ads. So for that what I have to do is I have to set up one more action tab and for receiving the email I'm going to use Gmail. So I'm going to select Gmail here and I have to give an action event. So I'm going to open this tab and send email will be my action event. So I'm going to select this. And I'm going to connect Gmail with Pabli Connect. So I'll click here on connect. I will click on add new connection and I will connect with Gmail. And now I have to click on allow to give access to my account. And my connection here is successful. Now here I have this tab of recipient email addresses. So I want to receive an email that I have received a new lead from Facebook lead ads. So for that I have to use my own email address as a recipient email addresses. So I'm going to type my email address here. So this is my recipient email address. Now what I need to do is I need to scroll down and I have all these tabs. So if I want to have anyone in CC and BCC, then I can give their email address too. Now what I need to do is I need to give my email subject. So here I have to type my email subject. So my email subject will be new leads received. And now I have to select my email content type. So my email content type is going to be plain. And if you want to send email as an HTML type, then you can select that too. But I want to use plain here. Now I have this tab of email content. So here I have to give the content or the email that I want to receive as an alert message on my Gmail account. So my email content will be, hello, we have received a new lead from Facebook lead ads and these are the lead details. So we are going to give the name, email, phone number and the city of my lead and my email ends with, make sure you check this out and not miss this lead. So here what I'm going to do is, I'm going to fill the details of the lead that I have received from Facebook lead ad and I'm going to map that details here. So for that I have to use mapping and what mapping is, mapping is a technique through which I can retrieve the data from the previous tabs and the data that is changing will get replaced with the new data in the real time. So for mapping I have to click here, I will give a space and first I'm going to map the name of my lead. So I'm going to open this response of Facebook lead ads and here this is the first name so I'm going to map this, I will give a space and I'm going to map the last name. Now similarly I'm going to map the email, so I have to click here, I will give a space, I'm going to open this response of Facebook lead ads and this is the email address, so I'm going to map this. Now I have to give the phone number, so I have to click here, give a space, I'm going to open this response of Facebook lead ads and this is the phone number of my lead, so I'm going to map this and similarly I'm going to map the city. So here I have mapped all these details and now what is going to happen is that every time I'm going to receive a new lead from Facebook lead ads, then automatically I'm going to capture the response of that lead here in Pabli Connect 
and here all the details of that new lead are going to get replaced because I have mapped these details and have made these details dynamic. So here I'm going to receive new details every time I'm going to receive a new lead from Facebook lead ads. So here I have filled all the required details. Now what I need to do is I need to click on save and send test toolkit button. And here we can see I have received this response. So this is a positive response and this means that I have sent an email automatically as an alert that I have received a new Facebook lead from Facebook lead ad for my business. Now to check this, let me take you to my Gmail account. And here we can see I have received this new email. So my email subject is new lead received and this email was sent to me. And this is my email content which is hello. We have received a new lead from Facebook lead ads and these are the lead details. We have the name which is demo user. We have the email which is demo user at the rate publitudes.com and we have the phone number. So this was the phone number of my lead and we have the city which is Bhopal. And my email ends with make sure you check this out and not miss this lead. So here in this email, I have received all the details of my lead that I have just received from Facebook lead ad for my business. So here we can see that whenever I'm going to receive a new lead from Facebook lead ad, then automatically I'm going to receive an email with alert that I have received a new lead from Facebook lead ad for my business. Now to check this in real time, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take you back to matter for developer. I'm going to close this and I'm going to create a new lead. So for that, I have to click here on this preview form button and this is my form. Now what I need to do is I need to fill all these details one more time. So here my first name is going to be test. Last name will be user. Email will be test user at the rate publicutes.com and I'm going to give a random phone number and the city which is going to be indoor. And here we can see I have filled all these details. Now I have to click on next. I will click on submit. Now here I have created this new lead. Now what should happen is that I should receive an alert email on my Gmail account that I have received a new lead from Facebook lead ads. To check this, let me take you to my Gmail account. And here on Gmail, we can see I have received this new email and the subject is new lead received. And this is my email, which is hello. We have received a new lead from Facebook lead ads and these are the lead details. So I have the name, which is test user. I have the email, which is test user at the rate publicutes.com. And this is the random phone number and we have the city, which is indoor. So these are all the same details that I've just filled in my lead gen form in Facebook lead ads. And I have used all these details to create a new lead in Facebook lead ads for my business. So here we can see that whenever I'm going to receive a new lead from Facebook lead ad, then automatically I'm going to receive an alert email on my Gmail account that I have received a new lead. Now that I'm receiving this new email, I'm never going to miss any lead that I'm receiving from Facebook lead ads. So here we can see that my connection between Facebook lead ads and Gmail is working successfully. Now let's go back to Public Connect. And here we have created this connection between Facebook lead ads and Gmail in such a way that whenever we are going to receive a new lead from Facebook lead ads, then automatically I'm going to receive an alert email on my Gmail account. So let's summarize what we did here. So first I have set up my trigger and my trigger application was Facebook lead ads and my trigger event was new lead instant. Then I have set up my action step and my action application was Gmail and my action event was send email. So this is how I have successfully created this workflow and you can also create this workflow by following all the steps that I did in my workflow. And I'm also going to put the link of my workflow in the description so you can check it out from there. And thank you for watching this video. Not just these applications, you can automate and integrate a lot more applications like this by using Pabli Connect. So if you want to reach out to us, then email us at support at the rate And if you have any queries, then you can write us at forum.pabli.com and if you have any issue with the pricing, then you can visit this link. And if you like this video, then please like, share and subscribe. Thank you.